trying to uh trying to make everything right again i work in sales and when somebody refers somebody to me and i sell them my product that i have i give i give uh the person who referred me like a little referral fee usually just it's like a little gift card to a, like a restaurant or uh, this time i did target but there was somebody who referred somebody to me and i uh made a sale off the referral and i didn't give them a I didn't give them any referral uh, bonus or fee or anything. And I felt bad about it. And uh, I just want to make it right. And so I just dropped off the first one. I'm gonna mail out the second one. And then there's also one other thing that I've been feeling really guilty about. Um, a couple months ago, I was at a bar and I got really, really drunk. And I thought it would be funny to steal some of their glasses because they're really cool. So I ended up stealing like three pint glasses and two goblets. And uh, I, I mean, I just, I don't normally do shit like that. And I felt a little bad about it, but you know, sometimes, sometimes people can ignore guilt, but it'll always be there. And what ended up happening is I was drinking out of those glasses with some friends one night and one of my buddies knocked a glass over and broke it. And immediately, I thought to myself, I was never meant to have those glasses. The damn microphone's creeping up in my mouth. <laughs> but I immediately thought to myself, I was never meant to have those glasses. And I knew what I had to do at that point, is I had to go either return the glasses or pay for them. So I'm gonna go down to the bar that I stole them, and I'm gonna freaking pay for the glasses. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go down there and ask them how much it is to buy those glasses. And when they tell me the total, I'm just gonna hand them the cash and walk out. I just wanna let them know that I'm sorry for taking their glasses. And I'm gonna pay for them. And I'm gonna keep the glasses. And hopefully that will right my wrong by doing that. So usually those glasses are like eight to 10 bucks. And if I took five of them, that's 50 bucks. But I mean, they could be more, they could be less. So there's a bank like right across the street from them. So I'm gonna go get out a hundred dollars cash. Damn microphone bugging me. <laughs> oh, oh well, I can't do nothing about it. My shield's locked. But anyways, I'm gonna go get out a hundred bucks cash and just pay them cash. And hopefully the next time I walk in there, they don't recognize me. <laughs> but if they do and they don't want me in there, man, then that's the consequence I have to pay. Hey, pink tacos. I hear they have a spicy taco. Oh, this is a pretty cool looking uh, little scenery right here. And it's over. Okay, I gotta admit, I am a little nervous doing this. I have thought about this for over a month now. But here we go. Right in on the sidewalk, okay. Two of the goblets. Okay. Yeah. So we've got different ones. Let me. You want two of those? Um. Yeah. I don't know. That's okay. Whatever design.
Yeah. Okay, cool. So, um, four each for these and then two each for these guys. So. I'm just gonna leave that there. There's a note okay. there, so. Oh, okay. Thank you. Thank you. Oh my God, I did it. Oh my gosh, I did it. I feel crazy right now. I feel like a freaking adrenaline rush. This is crazy. And they're super cheap too. A gobble was only $4. I was expecting boy. Oh, oh yeah! Hell yeah! Oh shit! Look at that! Oh shit! What? What? Oh my god! I feel like the, seriously. I feel like such a mad adrenaline rush right now. I had no idea this was coming. I felt like I just like robbed a bank right now. This is awesome. This is so awesome, man. Dang. Hopefully I can go in there again. I, I don't know, that's a good place. Goldstein's is what it's called. I forgot what it was called before, but Goldstein's. I'm sorry for stealing your glasses. Man, this feels, this feels so good, man. I feel like I'm gonna have a, a grin on my face for a long time. Hopefully that right, that wrote my wrongs, or I don't know what the saying is. Hopefully like, hopefully I made everything right. That was awesome. So, moral of the story, do the right thing, guys. 